I'm all about promoting maximum wear with your wardrobe, meaning that each piece that you invest in should be well considered, versatile, and be able to serve you as best as it can. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm Faye and I'm a personal stylist passionate about empowering you to feel confident with your style. Today is exciting because it kicks off the first episode of my brand new series, Wardrobe Workout. I pick an item from my list of wardrobe essentials to share with you exactly why they're an essential and ideas on how you can wear them for different occasions at different times of the year. For today's feature piece, we're talking about the classic white shirt. And it's exactly that, it's a classic. It's timeless, it's simple, and so you know that it will stay in your wardrobe for years to come. You can find it anywhere. Most stores will have it. You can find it in your partner's wardrobe, in your dad's wardrobe, your mom's, your siblings, your cousin, your friend. Guaranteed one person in your life will have a white shirt. Now the key to a versatile white shirt is the simplicity in its style. The shirt I'll be featuring in this video is from Uniqlo and it's a cotton linen blend. It's classic and simple in its style, so it definitely ticks the versatile and timeless boxes. The white shirt works really well because not only can you take it from day to night at any occasion for any time of the year, but you can also wear it many different ways and I'm excited to show you how. For my first outfit, we're going back to summer or looking forward to it depending where you're from. This was my go-to summer look. I've paired the white shirt with a neutral pair of linen shorts, making it super breathable for those hot summer days. For accessories, I've added a straw hat, a straw bag from Bali and tan sandals to tie the look together. You can see that I've only tucked half the shirt into my shorts to achieve that relaxed summer vibe. For the next look, we're going on a little date night. I've kept the base of the outfit quite simple, wearing the shirt tied on top of a black cami and paired with a classic black slip skirt. I've then added strappy midi heels with a classic YSL bag to keep the outfit looking chic. And to switch things up, I've buttoned the shirt completely wrong to give a little shoulder action and achieve a fun, flirty, yet effortless look. For outfit number three, this has got to be my signature look. I love clashing smart and casual pieces together. There's something really effortless about that. So for this outfit, I'm wearing the white shirt tucked into a classic pair of mom jeans and my favorite slim bags from Zara. I've then topped it off with a relaxed gingham blazer and a little black bag. This outfit says cool, calm, and collected. Okay, now for this outfit, I wanted the white shirt to do all the talking. I've kept it quite simple for the bottoms with a skinny pair of black denim. And with the white shirt, I've decided that I didn't need both sleeves. So I've tucked a sleeve under and wrapped it around to turn the shirt into a one sleeve wrap top. I then added a patent pair of booties to add dimension to the outfit and topped it with a sailor cap to add character and balance out the look. For the next outfit, of course I had to rock an all neutral look. This is my go-to for the current season because of the transseasonal pieces. 
I've tucked the white shirt into my linen pants and have gone tonal with a classic trench coat. Keeping to the classic theme, I've opted for a pair of black loafers with the gold detailing and added the cream fedora to tie the autumnal look together. I'm putting my hand up now to let you know that you'll be seeing me in this outfit on the regular. Moving on to the cooler months, nothing says winter like layering. For this outfit, I'm leaving the shirt untucked so that you'll be able to see it with the outer layers. And I've paired it with a pair of leather pants. For the layer, I'm adding this cable knit vest, which I'm currently so in love with. For the shoes, my classic cons, which are in desperate need for a clean. And to finish off, my sailor cap and a casual black bucket bag. For my next winter outfit, I've layered this shirt over a thermal. This turtleneck is from Uniqlo and it's been a winter staple for years now. I've decided to wear these light tones with a grey pair of pants and my favourite oversized grey coat. I literally throw this coat over any outfit over winter and I always feel that much more put together. For footwear, I've opted for a classic pair of combat boots and a cream pouch for contrast and to lighten the overall look. And for this winter look, we're doing all the layering. I'm wearing a long sleeve thermal under my white shirt and have layered this cable knit on top. Then I'm adding another layer, my teddy coat, which is the coziest coat of all and perfect for those cool winter months. I've kept the bottoms pretty simple with black skinny jeans and black booties to balance the look. Now for another signature look, mixing denim and a blazer, my absolute fave. Here I'm wearing the white shirt tucked in all the way into a pair of white distressed denim jeans. And to clash, I'm wearing a brown gingham blazer which adds a smart element to the mix. Continuing with the smart tone, I've opted for a pair of neutral slingbacks and to finish, a casual bucket bag. Again, a go-to look of mine because it shows you've got it together without really trying. And lastly, we're going for a completely casual and relaxed look. I'm wearing the shirt with a classic pair of mom jeans and throwing on a light layering knit over my shoulders to add another element to the outfit but also to stick to the whole relaxed, casual, but chic, comfy yet put together vibe. To finish the look, we've gone for a classic pair of loafers and a little black bag to add to the simplicity of the outfit. And voila! And that is the first episode of my wardrobe workout series. I'd love to know which look was your favorite, which look you envision yourself wearing and which look you're excited to try out. If there's an item that you're curious to learn how to style and you'd love for me to include into my wardrobe workout series, leave a comment down below. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, I'd love for you to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Thank you and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.